Okay, so a quote unquote urine therapy therapy group in Colorado said you can apparently drink your urine and cure depression, whiten your teeth, and uh, cure a stomach ache. Basically, just this guy says his life, the past 25 years or so of his life have been changed because he started drinking urine, basically, which is odd to say the least. And um, yeah, I don't know if anything that he's saying has any sort of validity, but I guess it wouldn't be that crazy if it did because I mean, who is going to do that? Obviously, something as crazy as that, no one's going to instantly believe you. But I guess there could be some truth to it. I mean, who's crazy enough to, to, well, obviously this guy, but like, who's crazy enough to do that and try and prove that to you that this is how it is. And in the video, he literally, you know, he literally just drinks urine and he basically lives by it it's it's fucking weird but you discover what this really is is ultra filtered blood plasma or urine ah two hours ago good year so when we take in this water we honor it we uh some people say a little prayer or something uh just acknowledge that something's about to shift in their body and in their mind do you think anything he's saying has any sort of validity to it at all well first let me uh say this if we're gonna look at the video base it off of you know just his looks he does not look like a very healthy individual <laughs> he honestly means. doesn't no he doesn't a really like frail gentleman blotchy skin you know, like, if I saw him walking down the street, I'd probably be like, man, that dude... Not healthy? <laughs> yeah, I'd be like, he needs to go to the doctor. He needs to take some fucking vitamins. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> it's funny how you said he said all this stuff, but didn't give any reasoning why it would be, why it would work, and why you should do it. He just said, oh, it will, it will do this, it will do that. And then, like, leave, left it at that. I don't think he knows like uh, let's, let's just say theoretically that it does do that the, all that stuff I don't think he knows that like why it, it does those things I guess like he just like knows it does that like say like for example it whitens your teeth or whatever I guess he just it fucking it whitened his teeth <laughs> apparently okay so if you're suggesting that other people do something and you think it gains a result, would you be willing to tell people to do it even if you don't understand it and don't necessarily know if, look, you can drink water every single day and get cancer, that doesn't mean that water gave you cancer. Yeah, right. Yeah. You could brush your teeth you know, every day and drink urine, that your teeth are probably clean because, you know, you brush your teeth, not drink your own urine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and yeah. I don't see how it could be healthy considering urine is, you know... It's waste, basically. Yeah, it, like, it's basically the stuff that your body is flushing out because right. your your body already got all the nutrients from it. Yeah. Yeah, like, if, if there was some, like, magical thing that I found that actually, you know, it produced results and it was something that was like something insane like that like drinking your own urine i probably wouldn't suggest it to anyone just because like you said i don't i have no clue how it does these things and it could very well do those things and also have very negative effects on top of those positive things well it, it's look not at the just doctor dry positive in the video you know he kind of yeah, you know, played devil's advocate right there and gave some counterpoints pretty much right away. Just like, if someone has, you know, an STD or an infection or was doing drugs or anything, you know. Yeah. Why do you I mean, think, look, why do you think they, they piss test you for drugs? Yeah. They piss test you because the drugs then exit your body via your urine. 
So, and why do you think STDs are transmitted through sex? Because they are through your sex organs, and what do your sex organs produce? Well, they don't produce it, but you know, your sex organs are a a um like an a outlet, thing for, you I know, guess. Yeah, urine. You know, so drinking it, I don't see how that makes like any sense at all. Yeah, it just I seems mean, like if you're in a survival all. situation. Yeah, I, I, I mean, it. sure. Yeah, I mean, cause, cause you have no other options. I mean, if you're and, you're fear- fighting for your life, then like, yeah. I can understand if you're someone who maybe drinks a lot of water, and you know, if you're um, so, so you know, you don't have a lot of waste in your yeah, your I guess. System. So when you pee. You know, you're straight up just peeing out water, essentially. I could understand, maybe. Yeah, like, like drinking maybe. that just because it's like, maybe that's not that bad, but that piss was straight yellow, bro. Yeah, that was that was pretty fucking disgusting. <laughs> and he gulped it. He didn't. Yeah, that was that was horrible. <laughs> and I guess like you were saying, well, and you and the doctor. We're saying like you don't know if this person does drugs you don't know if you don't know anything about this person uh what's in their urine basically uh but i guess he's saying he knows what's in his and there's nothing bad in his uh, he i'm assuming he thinks that like there is nothing you know that could be toxic to him in his own urine <laughs> but one you wouldn't you wouldn't necessarily know that Unless you're a scientist or something. And two, it's like... It's... I don't know. It's, it doesn't really matter that you think that. It's kind of just yeah, fundamentally I'm, wrong. I'm not an expert on, you know, urine and what it does yeah. to your body. But I would say maybe if you do it occasionally, it probably maybe. wouldn't <laughs> be a, cause a problem. But if you do that regularly... You know, if anything, you're just going to get dehydrated. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, I mean, and this guy's been doing this for years, he says. So, yeah. it's like... And if he what? if he's eating other things, I mean, if you eat, most things have water in them. Yeah, So, right. you know, if you eat an orange, you're intaking water to a certain extent. If you're eating apple or papaya, like he said... You know, any fruits, you know, fruits fundamentally have water in them. That's how they grow, you know. So, yeah, they hold water. So, he's getting water in his system no matter what. He's just not doing it, you know, doing the correct way. (laughs) And, you know, you're getting second-hand water. You're getting trace amounts of water when you're eating things. And then you're going and um, drinking there's trace amounts why don't you just drink water and still drink in your piss yeah i don't i don't um, that i don't understand like apparently urine has properties that water doesn't have which makes sense i guess but it probably also has negative properties i'm sure but like this guy's been doing it for so long it's just it kind of makes you think like i don't want to just up and call him like deranged or something i don't want to say he's fucking crazy but like (laughs) he's been doing it for years and hasn't seen a problem with it it's i don't know it's kind of (laughs) weird well you can do a lot of things for a long time and if you adjust to it you'll probably be fine but you know i guess so yeah whatever you get used to someone can get hit in the face for a career and get hit in the face every single day and then someone could get hit in the face three times and be like fucked up for for the rest of their life yeah you know what i mean it's Maybe his body's just, you know, naturally inclined to, you know, fight off any of the bacteria in his urine. I don't I, know. <laughs> I guess, dude. I don't know. It's 2020. We already have coronavirus. You yeah. Know, the sky is falling down. We might as well all drink our piss. Fuck it. <laughs> yeah, bro. Fuck it. 
it can't be any worse. So I mean, <laughs> if that'll if that makes Basically. life better, we might as well just all drink our piss. Yeah, I mean, hey, what if that dude is ahead of the curve? I mean, who knows? <laughs> I don't know, dude. Instead of drinking your piss, just uh, get a ba- an IV bag and fill the bag full of piss, and just put put that uh, urine straight in your vein, dude. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess Why waste that's time not a thing. ingesting it? Just get it right in your bloodstream. Piss <laughs> blood, baby. Yeah, um, I'm not going to say I hope you enjoyed because you definitely didn't. <laughs> I hope you found it at the very least interesting. And we'll see you guys next time.